Hello YouTube, my name is Joe Wright and today I'm talking about Metal Gear Solid 5. First, let's go over the bad things in the game. Unfortunately, the story is unfinished. There was a lot of drama with Kojima and Konami at the time, so unfortunately, the game's story is unfinished, which means that a lot of the time we have to do repetitive missions over and over again to pad out the game, and like I said with the story being unfinished, it just feels like there's a lot of cutscenes missing, there's a lot of missions without cutscenes, you just sort of go into missions without any context really, apart from like a radio call at the beginning telling you what to do. And it has probably the worst ending in Metal Gear Solid history. Unfortunately, the story is a mess because of this, but I simply cannot stand there and say that the game is awful because it has three open worlds. You've got Africa, Afghanistan, Mother Base, and they're all quite huge. And another thing about Mother Base is that you can actually build the Mother Base over the course of the game. And that's how you get all your weapons, guns, uh, vehicles, tanks, you know. You can upgrade your helicopter, you can choose how the base looks, you can upgrade how Solid Snake looks, give them different uh, robotic arms and stuff. And there's a lot of customization which I really love. It also has a lot of open-ended gameplay where you can you know, approach any situation however you desire in an open world. So you can snipe everyone from a distance or go in close with a tank or LMG and just blast everyone with heavy armor on. You can play this game any way you like. There are no restrictions whatsoever and I absolutely love that and I keep coming back to the game because of how open-ended the gameplay in this game is. The game is also incredibly long so, you know, you're not going to complete this in a weekend. It can take you about a month to complete. There's a lot of things to do. And sim missions are near enough impossible without the right gear. So there's a lot of grinding to get the best gear. And you know what? The side missions in this game are pretty good. You know, there's a lot of secrets and collectibles and easter eggs in the game, which I really like. And it's just a lot of fun. Venom Snake isn't the best protagonist, but I prefer him over riding any day. The game can still be a bit silly at times, but I kind of love that. Who is doing this? Such a lust for revenge? So yeah, overall I really do enjoy Metal Gear Solid 5. Unfortunately, the story is a letdown, but apart from that, it's a great game. Free open worlds, lots of customization. Lots of things to do, what's not to love, it's a great game, check it out. Both my ebooks are now available on Amazon Kindle. The New Order of Alexandria is a dystopian sci-fi adventure full of violence drama with plenty of gunfights. Paranormal Homicide is a supernatural horror set in my hometown of Runcorn, a murder mystery with a sinister twist. Both of my books are 18 plus so you never miss out on the dark and gritty details. Don't forget to follow our Facebook page The New Order of Alexandria for everything NOA.